And we are back. Pokemon Pearl Hardcore Nuzlocke this time around. We won the White 2 run. We won Pokemon Sapphire. And then we are coming off of a huge win with Soul Silver. So we are 3 0 as of late. And now we're going to see if we can complete this Pokemon Pearl Nuzlocke. Um, I did try Pokemon Sun, and I may or may not have wiped before I even got to the first island trial. So I have no idea what I'm doing in Gen 7. I don't know where anything is. I don't know the best encounters. I don't even know what the Z moves do. Like I have no idea what I'm doing. So I'm just going to need more time to at least get acquainted. I don't even know the Pokemon. Like I was struggling to nickname them because once you nickname them, you can't actually see what their real what the real Pokemon name is um, once you go into like the summary or in the middle of a battle. So like I was just like a fish out of water. So I am still excited to get a Pokemon Sun Hardcore Nuzlocke as my first attempt, but uh, I just need more time. So we're just going to hop over here to Pokemon Pearl and see what Gen 4 is working with. So as far as the team, I have already suffered one casualty. We lost my little Shinx, the blue electric cat. Um, I got into a tough bind right there in the mines and a Machop actually crit it. So um, its defense was so low, but my Turtwig had already gotten its uh, defense dropped twice by the same Machop. Um, so I swapped out the Turtwig because I didn't want to get crit from that range. And then the Shink actually got crit instead. So very unfortunate. I did have a ton of Pokemon weak to fighting. So it was just a really bad matchup all around. But I'm digging the team, and as far as Rourke goes, it's just like Brock, the the original um, Leaf Green gym leader here with his Rock type. So if you have a Grass or Water type, you usually you usually are looking pretty good. Um, so I'm not foreseeing too many issues with this fight. Um, if there's going to be any, it's going to be the Kranidos, the fossil dinosaur here. But let's see if we can beat Rourke without losing anybody. Again, already screwed up the Deathless run if that was ever a dream. As far as bans go, I'm actually not going to ban Gyarados for this run. I did complete a Pokemon Platinum Hardcore Nuzlocke way back, like six months ago. It's It was one of the first series I did on the channel. And um, I barely, barely beat Cynthia. And I actually had Garchomp on my team, and her Garchomp one-shot mine, which is just hilarious. Um, so I will ban Garchomp since I usually ban pseudo legendaries. Um, but I'm going to let the Gyarados slide since I actually lost my Gyarados in that run and I always ban Gyarados. So let's not ban Gyarados and see if that actually has any dramatic effect on the run. With all that being said right here, we got Turtwig versus Geodude. Turtwig versus Geodude. I think we're going to go for the Razor Leaf, get that extra damage. Yuichiro comes down. This should be a one shot. Geodude's physical defense is beautiful, but that is four times super effective. It's just not happening. It is just not happening. There you go. And second on the menu here is the Onyx. Same thing. I'm actually going to drop back with an Absorb here since Onyx's defense is so ridiculous. I'm wondering if the special attack from Absorb will actually compensate, but Absorb is is such a puny move it doesn't even matter so razor leaf was probably the play there but we should be fine just get a couple more absorbs in there also razor leaf has that tiny chance of missing so we eat the potion we're gonna have to eat a little bit of a rock throw here no problem and um, onyx did get a stealth rock down so if we um, throw anybody else out they're gonna take a little bit of damage but hopefully little turtwig here can just take it home and in my Platinum run, I did go with Chimchar, and um, the Monferno actually died really early in the run, so I didn't even really have a starter. So this time we are going with the Turtwig. I really like all of the starters for this region. So here is the Kranidos. I think we're going to lean into the Razor Leaf. It's more damage than the Absorb, and it has that potential critical hit. Um, we get the Quick Claw as well, so we go faster than the cute little dinosaur here. Let's see if we can get into orange. Oh my gosh, it goes all the way to 1 HP. That's got to be 1 HP. That is absolutely ridiculous. A sliver comes down. We're going to go for the absorb. 
the double quick claw, the cute little grass turtle pops off and fades away with an absorb. You love to see it. Really good stuff. And that is a Yuichiro sweep right there. Great stuff. Great way to start the Nuzlocke. So a whole lot going on. I'm very excited for a new series. Let's do this. I will see you either at a rival fight or the second gym, whatever comes first, or maybe the um, like little boss battles with like the galactic grunts. Uh, I'm not sure when that comes up. But as always, thank you so much for your time. I really do appreciate it. And I will catch you on the flip. Peace.